Hey everybody, Todd from Juno Bait coming at you with a little randomness tonight for the Catch 365 segment. A little kind of fish story, fishing report mixed in with like a tip kind of that raised questions. I don't know. We're, we're going to go with it. We're going to see where it ends up. Hopefully it makes sense or, you know, help some way or maybe just like the story. I don't know. So me and Trey went tarpon fishing the other night, took a trip down south, throwing the spool text, trying to catch some tarpon. And I got lucky, hooked three of them, and despite the awesome spool tech technology, still managed to lose a spool tech and jump off the other ones, but just getting the bites is the best part for me. So I started off, good tide, water conditions looked right for the silver digger. I like throwing the silver digger, I think it's just a good color. Don't mind me, I'm gonna get this no seam or mosquito that's on my foot, okay. So I like throwing the silver digger. Had it rigged on one of my very common rigs that I'll use when I'm snook fishing or tarpon fishing in kind of a rocky bottom. I had a short piece of 60 pound leader tied into a longer piece of 50 pound leader into the braid. And that 50 to 60 connection I really like because if I do hang up the spool tech or the jig, I can break it off and I don't have to retie everything. I tie on a spool tech, short piece of leader, you know, boom, boom, it's fast. So the silver digger was not getting bites. You know, all my different presentations that I like, you know, up top, down low, mixing it up, tried everything, fished some different spots, couldn't get a bite on it. And I have this weird thing when it comes to spool techs, if I've got one tied on, even if I have them in the bag, I hate to put a new one on. I don't, I just, it's a mental thing. I feel better throwing this one. Finally got to the point where just couldn't get a bite, thought maybe it was a color change, you know, needed a color change, needed a something. So I took and tied on the bear of money. So kind of natural, good all around color, tin extreme. And when I did, I just looking for a big change, trying to get something going, I cut out the short piece of 60 and tied right on to the 50 pound test. So I've made a, a change of colors and I cut out a little bit of leader weight and not 20 minutes later get the first bite hook the fish get him jumping couple good runs he throws it okay I'm good with that you know so still got the spool tack tied on with 50 pound there's some frays on the 50 pound I didn't I was lazy I didn't retie it and 10 15 minutes of casting boom get another one get a good hook set on him jumping and he actually breaks me off and that was on me because you know should it retied with the phrase in the leader, even as good as the spool tech is, can still happen. So I lost my bear of money, got two bites on it. I'm down to, I don't know, maybe 14, 15 inches a leader and being lazy, tied back on my silver digger. Now I've got silver digger tied back on, short piece of 50 pound fluorocarbon, kind of opposite, not really what you should have. And just tied it back on because I was curious could I get a bite on it? Was it the leader? I don't know what it was. And 15 minutes later, hook another one, get him jumping. He comes off. But in that time, three bites, three good bites, a couple other maybe bites. You tell me, does color make a difference? I don't know. Did the change that cutting out that little bit of 60 pound go into a little bit of lighter leader make the difference? Did we just get lucky, get the right part of the tide, the fish swim through at that time? I don't know. I'm not really sure, but I'll tell you what, next time I go, I'm going to probably have the bear of money tied on first and I'm going to tie it on with 50 pound, a little bit lighter, live a little dangerously, but as mean as that little change got the bite. So take notice of those things when you're fishing, you know, take note of the tide, colors, leader, all that stuff, because it all does add up or maybe it doesn't. Maybe it's just all luck and that's all there is to it. I don't know, but just keep casting eventually they're going to bite it. Something, one way or another. It's my random free-flowing thought for the day. Hopefully that helps or maybe it doesn't. I don't know. As always, thanks for watching.